Remember to subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell icon to never miss an update from First Cry Parenting. Dairy products for babies. When and what to introduce? Once your baby turns 6 months of age and starts eating solids, you will want to know when and if you can include dairy products in her diet. When can babies have which dairy products? Number 1. Cow's milk. Cow's milk is known to cause dehydration and iron deficiencies, which is why it's best to wait until the baby turns one year of age before giving her cow's milk. Number 2. Yogurt. You can opt for yogurt of the whole milk variant and without artificial sweeteners. You can feed yogurt to your baby in small quantities after 8 months of age. Number 3. Cheese. You can give your little one pasteurized cheese or cottage cheese once she reaches 8 months of age and after ensuring that she isn't lactose intolerant. In what quantity can dairy products? be given to babies. Children between the age of 2 and 3 years are recommended to consume 480 milliliters of dairy products daily, but dairy products should not be a substitute for breast milk. Whole milk. Whole milk consumption for infants between 1 and 2 years of age should not exceed any more than 710 milliliters a day. Tips. A. Use whole fat milk when feeding your baby. B. Avoid cow's milk since it's indigestible at this age. Yogurt. We recommend giving your little one 226 grams of yogurt a day. Tips. A. Avoid artificially sweetened yogurts since they're loaded with sugar. B. Make yogurt at home and serve fresh. C. Do not add honey to your goods, and use fruits for adding natural sweetness. Cheese. About 14 grams of cheese a day will give your little one the recommended dosage of nutrients for her growth and development. Tips. A. Use shredded cheese or melted cheese to prevent your little one from choking. B. Opt for cottage cheese as it's healthy and a great source of protein. What are the health benefits of dairy products for infants? Dairy products are a good source of calcium, vitamin B12, and protein. They help in developing strong bones, cognitive development and promote proper joint and organ development. What if your baby is allergic to dairy? You may notice the following symptoms of dairy allergy in breastfed babies. Fussiness, rashes, vomiting, crying for long periods after being fed, lack of proper sleep, eczema, dry skin, asthma, wheezing, congestion, ear infections, constipation. Green stools, with mucus or blood, bloating, gas. Things to remember before introducing dairy products to your baby. Check your family's medical history. Wait till your baby turns 12 months before adding dairy to her diet if your family has a medical history of lactose intolerance. Avoid cow's milk babies are not able to digest cow milk, go for homogenized or pasteurized milk, switch to low-fat versions after a while. Do not stop breastfeeding. You should not stop breastfeeding once you introduce dairy products to her, as your baby gets her main dose of nutrients from your breast milk. Consult a pediatrician. If your little one shows any signs of loss in appetite or lactose intolerance, consult a pediatrician. If your little one is allergic to dairy products, 
make sure to consult a pediatrician and wait a few more months before introducing her to natural dairy products.